Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Artus. In this video, I'll be showing you how to exit WhatsApp group without members knowing. So we'll be seeing if it's actually possible. Before we start, hurry up and check out the result for just under this video. So let's get started. Now in this case, you might be wondering, how do you exactly do this? So typically, when we go to our WhatsApp here, we will be able to see different groups here. So in this case, let's go and open up one of the groups that we have here. Now in this case, we have this group here. Now, in this case, if someone actually leaves a group, you should be able to see their name at the very bottom. Now, unfortunately, whenever you leave a group, it's going to actually notify other members on that specific group. So, in this case, it's going to say someone left. So, in this case, Bud actually left this group here. Now, to leave a group, typically, you just need to click on the profile icon that you see at the top left or by clicking on the tree that icon at the top right here and going to group info. Now from here at the very bottom, you should be able to see the section that says exit group. Now in this case, whenever you click on exit group, that would actually exit you from that group. But in this case, again, will notify other members on that group. Now, what are or what is the solution that we could do here? Now, there are going to be some alternatives, alternatives here for you to actually just uh, be out of the group or do not include yourself in the group itself. Now, one of them is to uh, basically change the notification settings here. So typically, when we go to our exit here, so we want to go to our settings. So in this case, we want to open up our settings here. Let's go open up. From here, we want to scroll down a bit, and you need to look for apps. Now, from here, you want to go ahead and go to manage apps. And from here, you want to look for WhatsApp. So let's just type in WhatsApp here. And from here, you should be able to see WhatsApp so it might, this might take a while, so let's just search it again. But once you see on it, you need to click on the actual app itself. So in this case, is going to click on WhatsApp. And from here, we want to go ahead and scroll down a bit and look for notifications. In this case, under notifications, you want to go ahead and disable group notifications. It should be at the uh, center section here. Look for chats, and you want to click on group notifications. Now, from here, you could go ahead and disable group notifications here so that whenever something actually happens within that group, you won't be notified and therefore not involve, involving yourself in that group. Now, in this case, you'll go ahead and go back into WhatsApp here and you could go ahead and open it up again. Now, also, an alternative here is by clearing the chats itself, but you can only do this if you're the group admin. So, you can go ahead and click on the tree dot icon here, and you want to go ahead and go to more, and from here, you want to click on clear chat. Now, then again, you could only do this if you're an admin. Now, also, alternatively, you could also mute a chat within the group itself. So, in this case, you go and open up your WhatsApp, go to your group, click on the tree dot icon here, and you have the option to mute notifications, which in this case, I already muted this group here. Now, in this case, if you really want to leave a group, well, in this case, you need to actually use the group exit option at the top left here. And from here, you should be able to, again, see the option that says uh, leave group. So let's just go to our group info and again just click on the exit group option here but in this case uh, that's about it so if you found this video helpful hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video